we're still in this whole point where we need to get to Lake Hylia. And I thought coming here was going to be fine. I looked it up. There's a Minish I didn't trade a Kinstone with that will start up the ability for me to deal with some stuff in the library. And I'm kind of glad I looked it up because I would have wouldn't have thought of it. I already thought I did this one. Oh, I did do this one. Found me, the wisest of the wise. Want to enter the temple? You can see the lake? Call that place the Temple of Droplets. I've heard rumors that one Minish actually did find a way in a long time ago. That Minish is Elder Librari, and he is in semi-retirement in the town library. Library should be opening soon. Perhaps you can go find him. Is that all I needed to do? Oh, hold on. I need to... OBS is bugging me with the way I have it set right now. Okay. I keep forgetting. Library is one of the two buildings in the town. I think it's two. Two in particular. On the northern side that I haven't been able to get into. The other one being the school. I think the library is this way? This building? I'm in charge of checking out books, it's not my problem. Still, I feel really bad for the girl over there in charge of returns. Welcome to the library! Hey, aren't you the Smith's grandson, Dilly? Enjoy your browsing. Okay. This week's top titles. Learn to like your like-like. A good guide to a bad pet. Gorman's Guide to Good Grub. Married to the Moblin. I'm sorry? This week's top titles. No, no, stop it. God. Wonder what I should check out today. Wonder what you should check out today, too. Oops. Aw, oh, pet like likes? No, there's nothing good about that. Yeah. Minish. What? Sometimes these books move on their own. I've seen it with my own two eyes. Don't tell me I'm crazy. I ain't crazy. God, he screamed. That was funny. Can't get up there. <laughs> okay. Hello. Hey, hey, this is no good, no good at all. The humans who checked some books out of the library, thanks to them, none of us can get back to Elder Librari. Of course not. How will he get by all alone? I'm so worried. I'm sure the librarian knows something about where those books went. I wish I were big, but I'd walk right up and ask her where those books went. Why are there holes? <laughs> can't get up the shelf because some human checked that book out. But at least we don't have to listen to Elbert Lombrari's boring old stories. Can I just jump off? Did I die? I'll be back. I think I need to go and talk to the librarian. Talk to this lady about the returns. Welcome to the library. Say, aren't you Smith's grandson? Mm hmm. The book missing from the bookshelf on the second floor? Yes, they've been checked out for quite a while. They're very overdue. Take a Hyrulean bestiary, for example. Be gone for ages. Checked out by a girl with a cat. She said she had a new cat at her house. Wanted to learn more about it, she did. There's the one cat that swiped at us that I remember. Oh, look at that. What, when did that come there? Oh, you show me an empty house? No. Why not? Let me know if something comes up. 
Found a house to rent? We'll give it to the receptionist. She deserves some love. Thanks. Can't wait to check it out. I think we can tell when we found someone now. Oh, shoot. Yeah, okay. I think she's in here, but I want to talk to this guy real Oh, hey. He's not even here anymore. Welcome, Deli. I really love this house. If you have an empty bottle, I can put one of my homemade charms inside. Just ask any time. I have an empty bottle. Want a charm? Please. Alright, there it is. Come back. You got Ferrara's charm. Your power and guard will be boosted for a while. Does it matter who you put in here? I don't remember. <clears throat> So now that I did that, what about the other two? Hold on. Like, I'm supposed to be dealing with with the book, and instead I'm all like, but what about you two? Things just aren't the same around here now that it's just the two of us. But you're both the oracles. Can't believe she found a place. I'm so jealous. I have a feeling they have something else that goes on with them. I vaguely remember having to do stuff with them. Dear Mom, I'll be next door if you need me. I see a book. Hmm, say, look at that, Dilly. There's a book on top of the bookcase. How are we gonna get it? We can't reach it, and we have no ladder. And I don't think just shaking the bookcase will make it fall either. The present, this presents an interesting problem, wouldn't you say? Because you can't just do this. Huh? A book from the library? Hi, Rolling Bestiary is that one? Yeah, I checked it out a while ago. You came all this way to get it? Wow, you're one dedicated librarian. But I don't know how to tell you this, but it's back at my house. Would you mind going there to get it? I just can't leave right now. See? Stupid girl. Stupid girl. Hold on while I use magic to get your book. Lazy piece of shit. Stay away from me, kitty. Hey. No, don't hit me. Yes. <laughs> hey, kitty. Ow! <laughs> kitty, why? like a piece of work. We got a library book called the Hyrulean Bestiary. I'm so glad. Now we can go and turn this back in. Wait, do I need more kin... I don't remember. I honestly don't remember if I need more kin stones. I know I traded like crazy last time. That's the post office. What the hell? A heart piece. Lately, Muto's been grumbling about how there's no work with any punch. I wish I could do something about that, but I don't even know what that means. Want a few kinstones? I hope they fit. Yes. That's a that's a heart piece he'll give. Hi, Gamer Pro. Wait, where? Oh. Feeling really motivated now. I could probably build a good-sized house in a matter of minutes. What? I can't wait to see what happens now. I'm sorry, what? I'll build here, I think. There's a Minish right there. What are you doing to the poor Minish house? <clears throat> Gaffaw, well that was a blast and I guess it did have some punch to it. And I'll wager I'm the only person who could have gotten it done that quickly. I'm sorry, what? Is it done? Wait, is the house done? <laughs> Hold on. Excuse me. Get out of my way, doggy. <laughs> it's not done. I'll build here, I think. Why are you still walking on it? No. I'm not buying your goddamn magazine. <clears throat> hey, 
Hey, look at that. Our long lost copy of a Hyrulean bestiary. Dilly, are you returning this book? Thank you so much. Can't begin to describe how much I'm looking forward to putting this back. I was so excited. Wait, how many books do I need to get you? Next up for your book is, let's see, ah uh, yes, of course, Legend of the Picari. It's been out forever. Checked out by a somewhat absent-minded scholar, I believe. Is this for the guy that's in the... What? <laughs> These houses, huh, kid? It's brand spanking new, I tell you, but I just need another ten and seek a woman like before. Well, if you know any nice young ladies need a home, let me know. I'll be right back. <laughs> I'll be right back. I'm gonna go get you another tenant. This guy is unable to do anything on his own. Here, you're the Oracle of Seasons, technically. Shall we make an empty house? Yes. Wow, thanks. This is a new house and everything. Yep, brand new. Brand spanking new. How come this guy is unable to find his own tenant? <laughs> Lined up a sizable pile of cash for my rental properties. Maybe I should start breeding pets next. Mwahaha. I'm sorry, what? Oh, Daly, thanks for coming. I love this place. I owe it all to you. If I have enough to follow you, I can put one of my homemade charms inside. Just ask any time. Alright, there it is. Come back anytime. You got Din's Charm. The strength will be boosted for a while. I don't think I ever used them before. What, huh? A book from the library? Oh, yes, of course. I need this day would come. Please come in. I am a researcher of the Cori legend and lore. My name is Dr. Lep. You hear about that book, Legend of the Cori, aren't you? Well, I hate to say this, but I haven't seen it in several days. Perhaps a mischievous little mouse has taken it. Well, I'm sure it's in this house somewhere. I just don't know where. I'm very busy right now, so why don't you just look for it yourself? Shit. Yeah, how is the weather in the winter? Yeah. <laughs> Damn it. <laughs> Poured it on the earth instead of actually in there. Yeah. Got water in my bottle. Put out your fire. How long is a while, I wonder? <sighs> I need something else there. Get out of my way, doggo. Excuse me. <laughs> Ezlo's red. Uh-oh, I'm turning back to normal. We went back to normal. We can finally get into his house. Estia thanks you for your water. She was thirsty. <laughs> what? Your hair looks like a butt. What? His hair? This is a guy. His hair looks like a butt. It does. Hi, Shads. Come here. Hey, do you know the clues that reveal the seat? I already know this. Oh, I need to go through the... Ch why, why, am I, why am I so daft right now? Chimney. Where the hell is your minish? Where did you hide them? We gotta go over the bridge. They also need to come here. Hello. Hey, I've heard about you, so you're gonna go ahead, are you? Well, onward to glory then, just don't die out there, okay? I'm sorry, what? Onward to glory, just don't die? Oh, because of the animals. 
Oof. Ah, it's no good. I just can't get anywhere. Man, oh man, oh man. Ow. No. Stop it. Kitty. Wouldn't there be some place like this behind one of the fountains? Well, let's get moving and see if we can find what that item that the Minish mentioned. It's supposed to be an item that allows us to move things while Minish size. It's Bodhi's friends? No. <laughs> no. The angry kitties? No. <gasps> I need that. I need the cape for that. Or the rock feather, or whatever the hell it gives us. Hey, a fairy. Wait a minute. Excuse me. I need that ruby. Get back. Apparently you could stun them. What is this? What is this? Got the power bracelets. You're filled with energy even while tiny. Yes. Yes. <coughs> filled with energy even while tiny. Get out of my way, Kitty. Kitty. I can just move giant, giant thing is like things now. I made it. I made it through that den of evil and came back alive. Amazing! Woo woo! Can I move things? Watch it. It'd be funny if you could just move the bed and then he'd be all like, "What the fuck?" <laughs> I'll move this over here. That's the wrong way. All right, I'm gonna I'm gonna come back. I'm gonna move it the other way. That's the wrong way. Look, my point is I don't know where these Picori are that you have hiding in your home, because there used to be a Picori house here, and I know they're here somewhere. I have a feeling that behind that one... Is he not concerned with his furniture moving? Yeah, I think the pots were in the way too, but I don't know how to get rid of the pots. Unless I could just pick them up. Is this the book? Hmm, I see. Oh, that makes sense. Human books are so interesting. And that guy, Dr. Left, living down there has a great sense of reading material. Give me it. It's a bit dusty up here, huh? Maybe I should do a little cleaning. That's a hint. <laughs> That's a hint. Oh, there's it is. There it is. Oh, ha, hey, phew. I want to return this book by dropping it down below. It's impossible without some extra weight here. My brother is so busy with a book of his own that he won't help me out. Maybe I could do it if I try again. Or maybe do it with me.
Maybe I'm supposed to do something to this book? Thanks for cleaning up now, but that's... The Legend of the Picori. I got it. Oh, look, you found it. Could I ask you to return that book for me, lad? You don't want to trade kinstones or anything? Okay, bye. Oh, the pots stay away. The pots stay gone. Oh, oh, but, uh, but, uh, but, uh. Come on, Minish. Get out of here. Alright, so the big question is... Which way am I going? This way. There we go. I see it, I see it, I see it. Is she mad at you for busting her pot? She doesn't care. Welcome! This is my new house. Uh, don't you just love that new house smell? And I was just thinking about building a new house, so this is great. You want a few kids cells? Let's give it a try. Better be something good. Swamp is minished just because of all the puddles. But, whatever. Going this way. Just, I'm just a tiny, small little link. So small. So small. Do the library afterwards. Go into the swamp. No. It's like thinks I already need a haircut. I'm like, no, not yet. Just wants a lop off my hair. He has a limit on how much longer he can cut it because um, technically we're probably fine going to a. Uh... Hey, have I gone in there yet? Wait a minute. Oh, I need to go down here anyways. I don't remember if I've been in here. Or if this was new. I think I've already done this. It's looking familiar. No, I haven't. Nothing else on the wall. Oh well. Okay. 
Well, the one thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna check and see, is there anything else? No, it's just that one, okay. I know where to go to get there. Because I have to go to the one minute point over here first. Which is gonna require me to have these on. And then it's on to this one. That one pain in the ass thing I've done. I think I've already gone in here, but I'll double check. Yep. Ugh, all the way down. Well, it should be easy enough to navigate the rate I'm going. There it is. Yeah. Ow. Oh boy, Kinstone. I'm not happy with that at all. I'm not happy with that. I mean, granted, the more Kinstones I have, the better, because the easier it is for me to trade them. But, you know. How many Tiger Scrolls do I have? Three. Oh, there they are. I need quite a bit more. I have gotten all the Tiger Scrolls when I first played the game, like when it came out. Um, I do remember them being relatively worthwhile to grab. I think one of them makes it so your spin attack does work almost instantly when you charge up your sword. Because right now my sword charge is really long, which is why I haven't really been using it. Back to the town, into the library. Oh my goodness, will you look at that? It's our copy of Legend of the Picori. It's been checked out for so long. Dilly, you deserve a medal for all this. I'm moved, deeply, deeply moved by this thoughtful gesture. Put it away. And the last book we still need is A History of Masks. I think it was checked out by Hagen, the mayor. How could he keep a library book so long? He's a public official. Because... I don't know. Isn't this Hagen? <clears throat> yes, that's me, Hagen. I am mayor of this town. What's that? You want a book, A History of Mass? Did you say I checked it out? Do you? Yes, indeed I did. Oh, wait, did I? You know these masks see everything. Maybe you should just ask my masks, in other words. Go up. God damn it, they're in my way. He's in my way. Uh -huh. Hi, Noogies. Alright, up and up and to the left. May took off for his cabin by the lake, clutching a book. We saw him go, but after the chest was open, the road to the Minish Woods was blocked. We won't be able to get through. When the mayor came back, he didn't have that book anymore, so he's at his lake cabin. I'm sure he just left it at his lakeside cabin. He's pretty forgetful like that. You want to go to the cabin by the lake? Well, let me just mark it here on your map. Uh, yes, there it is. It's right here. You should be able to find it now. I already know where it is. Thanks. Sure. Why not? The cabin by the lake is really quite far. I kind of figured it was going to be there, but I think you had to talk to the Minish first. Alright. Is there one that puts me closer? Probably not. I might. Eh. It's probably not going to be where I want it to be. Mm. 
No, it definitely is not. I believe I have to do it from here. Wee. Wee. <laughs> Link grows back to being big again. He's gonna destroy that entire bedroom. That would be fun and epic. Oh my god. It just grows up big inside of a Minish home and destroys it while all the Minish scream and fly everywhere. Oh. Let's go talk to her real quick. I think that's too... yeah. Mayor Higgins likes that cabin. So you can open up the library as early as you want, but you can't actually finish the book collection quest until you get the uh, moment. Once you try my new red potion, you'll never go back to the police stuff. Shall I fill you a bottle for 150 rupees? I don't have that. None for you? And I just use up a fairy, bitch. I can't even get a B. Remember back when you could get a B in the, the Super Nintendo one, Link to the Past? Get a B, put it in the bottle, release it, and it was like your favorite friend familiar that just beat the crap out of everything in the area. Angry bees. What, the B? Have you not ever seen the Super Nintendo, like, Link to the Past, uh, Quizzy? Link to the Past is fantastic. And the fact that, uh, you can do that, like, <laughs> that you can, uh, get a B in a bottle is, is great. That's why that note said, whenever a solution to the problem... Oh, wait. Now I need to be a Minish. You haven't seen Link, Link to the Past? Oh my god. I'm tempted to play Link to the Past on stream, but it is, it is epically long. It is really good, but it is a long game. I'm more and more like committed to wanting just to play a lot of the older Zeldas on stream just for because I know there's a lot of people apparently who haven't seen them. And I feel like you need to have seen them. Okay, what's the point in that? Oh. That's the point. Although I think everyone, a lot of people have seen Ocarina. Especially at this point, I feel a lot of people have seen Ocarina of Time. Did Mini Link just push that whole shelf? Yes, he did. That's because Mini Link now has a power has power bracelets. Don't fuck with Mini Link. <laughs> He's gonna rearrange your furniture. Got the book called The History of Mass. Stupid fucking mayor. Stupid mayor. He's the end man. <laughs> Basically. <clears throat> Would 
Would you look at that? I can't believe it. It's our copy of A History of Mass. That mayor of ours is a real piece of work, isn't he? Must have been quite a challenge to get this back from him. You are my new favorite person, Deli. Thank you so much. <laughs> you know, Deli, you've been now returned all our overdue books. Now I can finally get that bookshelf on the second floor in order. Hey, Sturgeon, books the shelf. Yes, yes, here I am. I'm here. I'll have these books put away. You can split. Oh, him. Isn't he, like, the sword teacher in Wind Waker? The bookshelves are back in order. Ah, oh, I feel so, so renewed. Show your browsing. <laughs> the library doesn't need this. You're not a huge fan of Zelda games, get you excited for Breath of the Wild too, because it seems like you're gonna be in an ancient tomb and you love ancient tombs. Um I think that's one of my things about Breath of the Wild that I missed the most was the fact that the traditional dungeons were gone. They had a semblance of dungeons within the machines. Um, and I haven't done them all. But uh they weren't traditional dungeons as Zelda's had before. So it would be interesting to see them do that. Hey, hey, listen up. This is good. The books are back now. It's true. Ha ha. Now we can get back to Elder Libari. So, you brought the books back? Good for you. Thank you. Please take this as a sign of our thanks. <laughs> 50 rupees. I need money. Spent it all trying to get, like, in stones. Give me something. Ah, it's so nice to have all my little books in a row. Hey, you. I haven't seen anything about, um, Breath of the Wild 2. I still need to play Breath of the Wild 1 some more. Right here. Whoa, 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 a visitor after many long weeks. Even Jotari has been away so long. I've all grown almost lonely. But what is it? What do you need? Hmm? You want to visit the Temple of Droplets? Very well, you're the first very such brave you are the you are the first such brave person in a long while. Stand on the clover in front of me. All right, all right, you kids today. No patience for an old man. Well, just stand right there, like I told you. Whoa, whoa, whoa. now open secret mystery panel. Oh, was that fun? Now then, it's up to you to pass the trial safely and recover the item you require. Oh, what fun I do to love the real nitty gritty of adventuring. Is he sending me to my death? Ow, ow, ow. I just smacked my hip on something. You don't have a hip. Well, not my hip. My whatever it is I have now. My brim? Whatever. That old fool must have loved sending people on dangerous missions. And how did that Labari get into the Temple of Droplets anyway? I guess the answer lies up ahead. Keep moving, boy. Fuck <laughs> Magically flip the slugs here. Magical boomerang. You're afraid to dive into Breath of the Wild and never come out. It seems so massive. It is massive. You don't have to do every tiny thing, but you can also do every tiny thing. And I think that's where I get, like... The thing is, the reason why I haven't finished it is because I love it so much and I love every aspect of the world. I keep getting stuck on the exploration rather than actually moving forward with a story but it's a great feeling because it's it's definitely one of those open world games where you really get rewarded for exploration and i that's it's kind of a must in my opinion for open world games that they do that in the water. Give me that. They got the flippers. Press A to glide through the water and B to dive. That's not the same as jumping. 
Mm, yes, yes, yes. Why, it all makes sense now, doesn't it, my boy? The bar used these flippers to swim to the entrance of the Temple of Droplets. She can't swim without them. So if you put these on, you should be able to swim too. Remarkable. There's a big rupee underneath there. That's your compulsion to do everything. What well, when the world is like rewards you for exploration? Like it's it's. I've said it before. Dragon's Dogma does not reward you for world exploration. That's one of the reasons why I like games rewarding you. There are chests hidden in the world for Dragon's Dogma, but the chests are what you would find with any other chest. They're completely bland. Um. If Capcom ever did anything with Dragon's Dogma from here on, they really need to put some effort into the world creation. I would love them to do more, because I love Dragon's Dogma for what, what it was. How do I get this open? That's going to be fire. Which we already know is going to be a thing, because we have the lights and stuff. Do I get a magic cane for fire? I don't remember. You move faster when you're not underwater, but underwater you find stuff. Oh, remember what I said before? How there was... Look. Underwater link. Underwater minutes. Underwater minutes. Um... There's gonna be underwater stuff in, uh... In the small... In the Minish Town. Well, now we can swim. Let's go to the Minish Town real quick. Find up a side with a pile of cash. What is she doing over here, by the way? Not yet. Not yet. No one wants to talk to me. I hate being here all alone. I wish I could find a nice place to live like the others did. It's gonna be another kinstone piece I'm gonna have to do. I don't even know where the other carpenter would be found. What was the one on the DS with the boat? Uh, Phantom Hourglass or Spirit Track. No, Wind Waker was on the GameCube and on the, um, the, uh, Wii U. But the one that he's talking about with the boat, that's either Phantom Hourglass or Spirit Tracks. I know I know it's right on that one, I just don't remember which one it is offhand for the boat aspect. Because I have both those games and I've played them. I have not beaten Spirit Tracks. Phantom Hourglass, I beat. actually pretty decent. Oh yeah, no, the Phantom Hourglass and Spirit Tracks were really, really good uh, for what they were. They're, the, the control scheme for controlling them kind of had that uh, not quite a Zelda feel to it because it was all stylus based. But despite that, it was they were still really good Zelda games for what they were. Oh, there's the... Um, I forgot. There's all those places we need to swim to now. Why can't I get up there? <gasps> what? Can because you need to swim to like one of these points. That's why you need to be able to jump. Or a shallow spot. Fuck. Played like half, put it down, couldn't remember what you're doing, and you came back. Oopsie. Yeah. They're relatively okay. Phantom Hourglass is the one that had uh, a lot of criticism based upon its uh, Phantom Hourglass dungeon. 
that you had to redo over and over and had a time limit. It was tedious feeling because of that dungeon. Other than that, the game was fantastic. What is it? What do you want from me? You're after my bean, aren't you? Well, I'll never tell you where it is. It's mine, mine. Do you hear me? Mine. But I suppose if you could use Kinso with me, I might tell you. How was I? Did I sound like an elder? I've been practicing my elder ease. Want a piece of kinstones? The only problem you had with Spirit Track was the instrument playing parts. I don't remember those parts. But I probably would agree with you if I remembered them. If I saw them, I'd remember them. Maybe I'll get lucky now. How do I get behind there? Oh. I like the I do like the pixel art with it. I like the fact that it 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 kind of has that feel of the newer Zeldas at the time period. Um, it definitely felt like a step up compared to the previous handheld Zeldas because before this, the handheld Zelda games that we had were um, Link's Awakening, Oracle of Ages, and Oracle of Seasons. This was a huge step up for a Zelda handheld. Oh boy, can some piece. I'm so glad I came in here. Uh, it was the parts where you have to repeat the parts given to you by the Picori and there was a certain guy you struggled with. I don't think Picori exists outside of this game, I want to say, but I might be entirely wrong with that one. But I don't remember the Picori ever being referenced outside of Minish Cap. Um... Oh, can I get over here? I can. Oh! Alright. I've been here. I don't think so. Ooh! Locomo. Not before Locomo. Yeah, I don't remember that. I, ha I had to have done it, but I don't remember it. Give me this. Look, guys! You have found the true master swordsman of Hyrule, Wave Blade. You train with me, I'll teach you skills that will make you a master. So, would you like to train here? Now you will learn a dangerous technique for desperate times. The Peril Beam. First, you must have only one heart left. Second, use your last ounce of strength to swing your sword. That's all, young swordsman. Do you understand? Yes. So, there is no turning back now. But one must feel the technique, not just hear about it. That's why I will now possess your body, so as to demonstrate the technique. This is the Wave Blade Possession Technique of Training. Watch this. Possession! Phew. 
Phew, now you must try it yourself, when you have only one heart left. Swing the sword with the last of your waning strength. Yes, fine work, you know the way. I will now give you this tiger scroll if you ever forget this technique. You can review it with this sword. It sounds horrible. Hi, Slaughter Daughter. <laughs> I don't want to do that. Give me my hearts back. Thank you, little bitch. Now there's nothing more that I can teach you. Your training from now on is all in your mind. Where the sword leads ever upward. Yes! I don't remember where the other masters are. But there is another one that we had found, plus the ghost one. The ghost one I remember. The other one I don't. Now we can get back there easily. Get over there. Which is right over here. Surprised they're not charging a premium for the training. Look here. Bear! Chatter chatter, I'm freezing in here. If you don't find that element quick, I'm gonna turn into a hacksicle. Hurry up, Jelly! In other words, fire. We're gonna get fire in here. No, no. What? This floor is made out of ice. Be careful not to fall and freeze your backside to the floor, Dilly. Oh no. Yeah. Stop it. Stop it. Yo. This is a door I have to open because that sunbeam is something. Oh, I remember this. Yeah. <laughs> hey. hey, the sunlight's shining through. Ah, it's so nice and warm, I can feel myself starting to defrost again. Because you go here, and I have to get the ice in the sunbeam. Hmm, it looks like something's frozen inside this chunk of blo block of ice. Jilly, why don't you go take a look? It's a key, you idiot. I need to get it in the sunbeam. Just melts instantly. I got a small key. I wonder what it's for. Possessed fire. <laughs> look. Ow! Can I block this? Yeah. I'm going this way. Don't follow me. Don't follow me. Stop it. Stop it. Hi. Hi. <laughs> that is way more manageable than the ice sliding Pokemon puzzle. Yeah, well. <laughs> we have this one now. Um. Go. There. Oh.
Is that the master key? I don't think I need to solve this just yet, but... down there, it's not going to make any difference where it's located. why to put it there. The way, the reason why I have to be able to close that door, well, aside from being able to walk across, is I need to be able to get the ice over both, like, several blocks over there, I think. I have to solve that puzzle. I don't think there's any other options for that. Why is this block slightly ahead? This is trying to give me an indication to move this one first. Unless I'm really supposed to be doing, like... Tiger. Why why do I have kitty paws here? Oh, wait a minute. Can I just do that? Do this and then move it over and then it'd be fine. Yeah. Got the big key used to open big doors. <clears throat> there is one big door. It's the only other door. You have to close that because there's no way back up and across. That's why that switch is there. Here I was thinking it was a, like a lot more than that. This looks to be the element, all right. But what will we do? We can't even touch it while it's trapped in that ice. We need to melt it off somehow. Why are the pots... The pots are seeking revenge. God. Oh, no. It's a giant frozen Octorok. Oh, boy. Ow. Oh my god. 
This is the biggest dungeon we've done so far. Hi. Big dungeon. Yeah, it's big. It might be deceptively big, though. Look at that. There's something about, like, just going underwater near a waterfall in this. Get the hell out of here. Die horribly. <clears throat> I need to find some of the other sword masters. I think I'm supposed to have other, like, tiger scrolls at this point, but I'm not certain. I don't have any keys. back up. It's a little ridiculous, but okay. <clears throat> wow. <clears throat> <clears throat> Alright. What is this? The way forward is hidden in the bottom of the pot. What? Gothic 2? What? Pot? <laughs> oh, I got a key. Oh, because... Oh! The bottom of the pot. Ha 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 I just went under because it looked like it would, something would be there. Oh, shit. Okay. Oh, I have to go back to that one locked door. Not a real pot. Hee hee hee. I'm gonna sneeze. <coughs> Excuse me. Excuse me. <clears throat> Sorry about that. I wonder if that's a sign that allergies are starting to bug again. Uh -huh. Wait a minute. Oh no. It's your season lot right now. You think allergies? Oh no, allergies in our area definitely have been around. <clears throat> our area gets really bad with allergies. Ow, I thought I got that in time. I guess not. Um, I take decongestants when it gets really bad. I have a bottle here, but it hasn't been bad today. It's just now bugging a little bit, but allergies aren't that bad today. <laughs> you 
we've been having to keep the mask on everywhere besides the plague. <laughs> Or charm. I don't know how well the charm would work on bosses, so it's just like, screw it, I'm just gonna use it on him. <clears throat> Besides, I don't remember ever using any of their charms when I played it the first time, so I don't think you really need to. Oh boy. Compass. Well, that was worthless. Vacuum in the spider webs, I mean. <clears throat> Stop it. Um. Are needed for anything. They're not giving much of anything. The position of these ice blocks. Yelp. Shit. I see it. Miss my snowshoes from Oracle of Seasons. <laughs> Pokemon Ice Puzzle. Yeah, that's what um Quizzy said earlier. She's all like, at least it's easier than the Pokemon Ice Puzzle. I never played that one because I was never into Pokemon games, but Isik would know exact I know Isik's made references to it. Oh, there's a Ugh. <clears throat> I think he mentioned it was really bad to me. Do I have an all-time favorite romance movie? Um, I don't really do favorites all that much. Romantic movies, like romantic comedies and stuff. I haven't really watched a romantic comedy that I've really liked in a long time, and it's partly because they all kind of follow the same formula. I, I hated Twilight. So did the large majority of people. <laughs> But <clears throat> Path to the Dragon Badge in second generation suck. It was a Dragon Badge at one point in Pokemon? I didn't even know that. Are you fucking kidding me? I have to redo that? Aw oh, man. At least it's easy. Get over here. Get over here. I guess it's a one-time thing. You don't really need to do it again. That would be the only reason why I could see that you have to do it. Can I play the first Final Fantasy game? Final Fantasy game? Uh, unlikely, only because it's very grindy. I have played it a long time ago when I was a kid when we rented it from the video store on our NES. 
it's a game where you would see if you've never seen it actually streamed live or played live it's basically someone playing the game and then spending hours running around and killing things over and over and over before you run to an end and then going around and killing things over and over and over before you run to an end it's incredibly incredibly tedious to watch it's enjoyable enough to play but it is it is the bare minimum of RPGs. Not discounting anything because at its time it was like one of the only ones of its time, at least on the NES. Um, <clears throat> there's a lot more interesting RPG games out there in my opinion, such as like the Ultima series, which came even before it that did a lot more, but that's also because the computers could do a lot more. How am I getting that? <sighs> I don't have any plan to want to play the first Final Fantasy game. There's a possibility for all I know that Isaac wants to do it at some point, though. Um, because I know he was going... He's been the one that's mostly gone through the Final Fantasy games on our channel. Um, and I love the Final Fantasy series in general. Um, but yeah, the earlier ones are a lot of grinding. A lot of grinding. Tell me, where are you? Are you still under there under me? It's so dark, I can't see my beak in front of my face. Watch your step, I don't want you to trip over anything. <laughs> Did they remake the first Final Fantasy, though, at one point? There's a remake of it. I don't even remember what it was on. I know there was one on the mobiles at some point. I am kind of curious to see what it looks like. When I played the first Final Fantasy, I actually never got far enough to actually upgrade the characters. I think you needed the rat tail for that, I heard. Um, yeah, because the, your starting characters aren't the finalized classes you get. You're supposed to get a rat tail at some point, and then they, go, they get upgraded beyond that. Really easy to just stun them. You did what you forget what they were called. Yeah, I do too. They did a few times as a PS1 remake, a Game Boy Advance remake, and a PSP. I think the Game Boy Advance is the one that I saw. You know, the one that skipped by me that I really wanted to get was the Final Fantasy VI remake that was on the Game Boy Advance. If I played any of the old Final Fantasies, I'd want to play VI because I never ever beat VI, and VI is supposed to be really really good. Five is another one I would consider doing, just because I I did play five a little bit, and I think Final Fantasy V is the first Final Fantasy where there was a death of a major character. And it took, like, the players by surprise, because no one expected it, and it was, like, near the end of the game or something, one of the major characters was just killed off in the story. Oh my god, six squee. Okay, you go back to Lurky. <laughs> hi, Griffalo. Hi, Griffalo. <laughs> of course, sunlight. Once we get some sunlight in to melt the ice, that element will be as good as ours. Um, if I ever do Final Fantasy 1, I, I might do it as a one-off, or maybe do, like, a few episode, a few of it. It's not like I haven't thought of doing it. Um, but like I said, it's long-term doing it from beginning until end. Ugh. I don't know how well it would go over just because of the grind factor. And I do so much for the stream right now, when I'm not streaming, that trying to grind on the side would take a lot. I need to go to the right. No, there's a thing up north, though. To the left and up north. What is that? Can I get to that? I don't know. All the way up. Oh. Because it's up there. I need to get that from the other room. You like six, but it's weird because your stats don't increase on their own. I mean, that's not necessarily bad. It's based on which Magisite your character is equipped, you won't have many for the first half to get in six? 
I don't remember that being the case for six with what I had played of it. But it might be. I don't know. Um... The only game I can remember that had something similar to what you're describing was 8. Do you remember Final Fantasy VI? Yeah. Did you have to equip Magicite for your stats? Yeah, I don't, th I don't know which one you're talking about, Mike. Unless it's something they did in a later remake of it. I don't... Yeah, I don't remember. But that's what Mike's saying. I don't remember. I haven't played Six this week. One second, guys. <laughs> Honey, things like that, just, just wait until later. Yeah, but you don't need yeah, to- Yeah, Griffalo, um... How are you? Griffalo's, uh, clerking, mostly. He said hi. Good. I know. Do you know if you're streaming tonight or if I am? It's up- I don't care. Um... It's up to you. Do you have a single game or do you have, like, five games I you're gonna play? What? Pokemon. Oh, Pokemon. I forgot he's doing the Nuzlocke, yeah. Nuzlocke's doing a Nuzlocke challenge with, uh, one of the... R it's an RPG maker, what is it, Xenoverse? This was the GBA version. I wonder if it's something they changed that... Oh, you know what? I think I had heard, Mike, that they changed some stuff with the GBA version because it's possible in the original version to make your characters overpowered. It's the same as within Final Fantasy 2. Before they did the remake, the original, original Final Fantasy 2 that was released in Japan was easily exploitable based upon the system that they had. Because the system was based off of your stats increased based on you getting them increased. So if you went to a, a battle with low-level monsters and had all of your characters just punch each other in the face, you would increase their defense to, like, disgusting proportions. Sounds horrible, but that's pretty much what everyone was saying you should do in that game. I remember that. Uh, what is good about this? Okay. What happened? Oh. Oh. Well, this was super simple. Does this even count as a puzzle? <laughs> Got a small key. Use it to open locked doors and blocks. You can use it only in this dungeon. Yeah, I played um, the last Final Fantasy game that I, like, I can't say the last Final Fantasy game I played, but um, the last of the older ones I played was Final Fantasy IV, and I played the DS remake. I really, really wanted them to do something like that with Final Fantasy VI because I never got really a chance to play Final Fantasy VI. And the DS remake of IV, which is the same one you can get on Steam now, the one that's 3D, is fantastic. It's so good. It plays good. It's just so good. You smell your dad cooking. Now it's making you hungry. Oh, isn't that the point of that? Uh-oh. Oh no. The little bastard. No, ow, ow. Good luck beating the Chichu. Choo -choo. Yeah. Well, now I'm getting used to rolling everywhere, so. That 
That's you too. Remember when you have to harvest them for like potions in uh, Wind Waker? Makes you actually want to fight them. You're all like, oh my god, she cheers. <laughs> Yo, ow. Was it ready? I was not emotionally prepared for that. No, no. Ow. Ow. You little bitch. Stop it. Port of the War of the Lions. Haven't they done? Oh, the Flame Lantern. This handy item lights up the night. Press the button. Turn on now. Oh, no. <laughs> so, like, what did you find in this dungeon? What magical objects did you get? Buy this at the store for 10 rupees, but okay. <laughs> um, I liked Final Fantasy Tactics when I played of it. Um, I don't have strong opinions of it one way or another, just be probably because I didn't get far enough into it to really like it. I was liking it. Um, I didn't like streaming it. I liked it, but I did not like streaming it. People get very backseating with that game, and they get very much into the you're playing it wrong mode, and it's just, it kind of really kills the enjoyment of it. Um, but what I had played of it, I really liked the concept of it. There's been other games similar to it, but I, I do feel like it did a really good job with what it was. <sighs> Are you kidding me? What happened? No! No! Oh, okay. I thought it, like, I thought it, like, broke. Somehow, the computer, like, unfocused the window. I don't know why. I thought I had lost everything. There's no magic meter in this, so it just lasts as long as you want it to, which I'm fine with. Thought it froze. No finish cap, the name you could never complete because you legit could not solve one dungeon. You are not the only person that has said that. There's so many people that have been like, Minish Cap, the game that I got stuck on, or couldn't finish, or whatever the thing is. I finished it. Um, there are some challenging puzzles within it. Um, a lot of it, especially in between the dungeons, requires you to have to go around and talk to the townspeople for each of the puzzles. Like, I spent a lot of time yesterday doing, um, kinstones. The only reason I had to look up a guide, because I stupidly forgot to talk to one minish. Um, but when I played this on my own, I, I, I did it from beginning to end without a problem. I don't mind looking at a guide now, just because I beat it back when it first released. Still have no idea where the final dojo is. Are you talking about for the Tiger Scroll? That's the final, final Tiger Scroll is in... I can't show it to you right now. It's in the graveyard. There's a, there's a uh, guy that's a spirit, and he says that you need to come to him, but only after you've collected the other Tiger Scrolls. I've already found him, and I've unlocked him. He's just like, he's all like, I will teach you what I know, but you first need to have other Tiger Scrolls. I'm like, okay, whatever. Edgy old man, whatever. I don't even remember if you need the Tiger Scrolls, honestly. Can you guys calm the fuck down? 
like are all on crack or something. Got a small key. You got all the others, but you could not find him in the graveyard. It's just one. No, he's in the swamp. Hello, he's in this in the swamp in the bottom right bottom left corner of the overworld map. There's one giant gravestone in the swamp. You just need to push that gravestone, and he and it and it leads down to him. Oh, I need a light. I, I was gonna point him out to you on my map because yeah, I could see him on the overworld map, but I can't do it right now. This is a dungeon map. Yeah, we found him like two streams ago, I wanna say. I've, I've found three dojos. I'm trying to remember where one of them is. Um, there's the one that's in the town that's obvious. There's another one that I think I can actually unlock something from at this point. But I don't remember where he's located. I'd have to look again. Ow, ow, stop it. Stop it. Honestly, at this point, I'm getting to the point where I almost... Maybe I should just... Stop. Just get out of here. Ow. Ow. Why did I do this? I came back in here because I was like, maybe there's something more. Problem is, if I keep on continuing as I am right now, on this low of life, I'm not going to have problems. And I only have one fairy. where ah I see it really I get it. Yeah. You dumbass. One. Aw, oh, damn it, I ruined it. Fuck. <laughs> that was on it. I was only supposed to push it down one. three of them. Can I push these blocks? Hold on. find out.
this one's gonna be a pain. Yeah. Oh. Shit. Alright, first things first. This ice block. Damn it. Before I even attempt this, I don't know why I'm doing it this way. Hold on. I'm being an idiot. over here. Uh, well, there's, I mean, there's a treasure down there, but, oh no. Oh no. easier than I thought it was going to be. I thought they were going to go out very quickly. Everything in this game is super stingy on hearts, which I'm not against because it, it, it adds some level of a challenge to it. Because honestly, Minish Cap, aside from its puzzles and people getting like having difficulty figuring out where to go, um, it's a relatively easy Zelda game. 
Like, it doesn't feel anywhere near as challenging as other Zelda games have. Yeah, 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 I see that. Now... Yes, I'm leaving. The primary, me like, idea that I have... I have the lantern, and I also have, like, nothing going for me at the moment. Um, I desperately need some potion or something. I guess I didn't get that. I thought I had... Yeah. Yeah. Real quick, didn't didn't these things need like um, lanterns over here and up there? Maybe. Ow! Got it. No. Do you want a kinstone piece? I think I already talked to you. Get away from me. I don't ever want to talk to you again. You have no friends. You live in this house all alone. <laughs> that poor Picori just lives up there and he's like, why will no one ever visit me? And we're all like, because you decided to live in the middle of nowhere, you dumbass. And he's like, excuse me? And they're like, she can be heard me, you dumbass. Will that stay lit? Is there a reason to do that? Yes, it will. I wonder if that you need to light these for some reason. That's part of what all this is about. It's partly why I came back in here, because I remember the torches and I was like, it's very odd, but sure. No, it's just there for your own, so you feel better about yourself or something, I don't know. Congratulations, you lit the torches. I'm like, oh boy, thanks. Does it stay lit? No. Is this supposed to... Is this one of those things where it's like the water sparkles, if there's something under the water, if you have to light up an area? I don't remember. There was... a place... the inn. The dojo that I need is the one where the guy said it was too dark to see anything, so he couldn't teach me anything. Where was he? No, that was the... Uh... Also, oh, there's that one lady there. I need to use the bathroom. I'll be right back. Just a quick BRB.
Oops, sorry. No, the mic was not on. That was my fault. I'm doing wonderfully. Sorry about that. I looked up where Grimblade was real quick because I remembered Dark jo Dojo that I needed to use the fire for, but I couldn't remember where it was. Um, so I'm glad I ended up looking it up because I was going to search for it on my own and the garden was going to be one of the last places I would have looked at. Um... No, I'm glad you said something, because I would have kept it off. I, I completely forgot. It's my own fault. Um... I need to go to... Oh, I can swim through here. Oh, I can swim through here now. Oh, shit. Stop. <laughs> I did not expect that. Crap. This looks like this looks fine. Okay, up here. Only for kinstones. That's why I'm like beating up the bushes mostly. I mean, I can use some money, but eh. Shall I feel? Yes. Got red potion. Drink it to replenish your life. Come back when you need more. <laughs> I'm running around and prepping to go back into the dungeon. I was thinking, wait a minute. What if I just get another bottle of her stuff and then just use it on the boss? <laughs> on a charm? Yes. Alright, there it is. Wow. Mm. 
Bumpy. Yeah, okay, I still got it. <laughs> Get out of my way. Oh boy, how many of these do- I have 969 shells. Don't care about those things. No, no, get out of there. <laughs> Stupid bear, just even bird. I need to switch over to Lust from Beyond in a bit, but I kind of want to finish this dungeon. But why does it say, like, this room hasn't been explored? Oh, it has. Okay. Oh, because it- no, not fully. This is where I left off. Bastards. I do like you can have the lantern out at the same time as you're ready to do certain things. Or like, while you're swinging. And then it increases the light in the area. It's probably- this is probably one of the best uses for the lantern in any of the Zelda games I've really played that I can think of. Just because... it's useful. there's a lot of chests in this game in this one that I'm not gonna be able to easily grab not without retreading my steps and I feel like a lot of them are just gonna be rubies which I don't desperately need but would be nice I definitely don't desperately need them at this point not unless I'm gonna have to buy some kin stones I think this is what I need to melt the ice, I want to say. Which is also going to melt the uh, Octorok. Because we're going to be all like, oh look, it's right there, and then the Octorok is going to start moving. Did it, Deli! Now we can take the element. That was a lot of trouble, but we finally did it then. What in blazes? Hey, something's not right here. Yeah, I know. The giant frozen Octorok in the fell. It was probably a normal Octorok. Oh, he's going to suck. What? What's this? That stupid Octorok stole our element. Don't just stand there. We've just got to go get it, Deli, now! Um... I remember what these bottles... These two do. <laughs> Ow! Blade technique. Look at that. Can I go backwards and just grab the, uh, the chest now? Like, why are you doing this? Just go. I'm like, okay. 
Oh no. Hi. Oh, I have to block them. I have to throw them back at them. My tiny little shield. Wasted by Din's thing for you. Ow. every other one, so now he's going to try and suck me in. Yeah. Stay away from him. Damn it! Mm -mm. 
He is a pain in the ass. I see the pattern. It's not a very obvious pattern at first, but it's dealable when you know what to look for. But I might have to redo this one. Kidding me? Is another gimmick to this? He was frustrating until I got the whole, like, idea of how to get to his tail. He got the water element. Water quenches thirst, ends drought, and nourishes life. The water element is the embodiment of that power. No! Yo, yo, yo. Yo. I almost froze my beak off in there. No, no, no. But what? Oh, young one. Child who seeks to aid the princess of Hyrule. My name is Gustav. I know you want to go and get that heart that you left behind, but I was king of Hyrule countless ages ago. Stand before me. Only then will the path open to you. Hmm, what was was that? Just a dream? He said he was king of Hyrule. Wait, look at your map, Dilly. There's some kind of mark on it. Hmm, I guess that means it wasn't a dream. We should head there once we've infused your sword with that element. To the elemental sanctuary. Fucking hell no. Not yet, we're not. So upset power it wasn't there. <laughs> I honestly don't really care about the uh, chests that I missed. They're probably either kinstone pieces you don't desperately need, or they're um, 